Riri just told Sus to get all this shit back in and just left the car running in front of that place. R Riri literally just dumped Sus live on stream right now. Perfect time for me to go to Thailand. <laughs> Perfect timing. I wonder why that would happen. I don't believe it. She'll be back tomorrow. She'll be back in five minutes. Like, real, she'll be back in 30 seconds. No, she'll be she'll be back immediately, bro. Like, she obviously oh, needs no. him. She needs him. You know it's serious when it's an unattended stream. No, no, bro, you know it's serious when it's an unattended stream, nah, bro. She needs him, bro. Obviously. She'll be back within seconds. Yo, someone posted a clip in my Discord. She's, she's probably just faking it. She'll probably, they're gonna come back together and it's gonna be fine, like normal. Like literally. Didn't he just put everything in her name? Yeah, no, they just got, <laughs> they just got an apartment together. She won't leave until everything's in her name. That, then, then I'll believe it. Chat, like, what caused a it? A car in her name, the apartment in her name, a business in her name. It's probably. It's probably just an emotional like, oh, outburst, you know what I'm saying? Just normal emotional outbursts. Oh wait, he's back. Oh, he's pissed. He's fucking pissed, bro. Apparently he lost his shit with her because um, uh, she, she apparently works all day long and doesn't pay any time with him. Spend any time with him. And apparently he lost his shit. He lost his shit on her? Yeah. Because she doesn't spend time with him? Yeah. But bro, sorry, I love stuff a lot. I think he's, I think he's a, just a lost guy. They spent every, but, every time I open his stream, they're together. What no, do you mean? But bro, she doesn't want to spend time with him. Like when he leaves the country for months, she doesn't give a fuck, bro. Like she's like, oh great. I get to just fucking spend money and do whatever I want now. Sus isn't here. Like, come on, bro. I'm sorry, it fucking sucks. But that's the reality of it. I, I mean, mean, that's pretty... Jack's uh... saying he's controlling as fuck. The only reason he's controlling is because he's hyper insecure in the relationship. He's scared, that, he's scared that she's... I mean, is he control? I don't think he's controlling anything. No, he tries to, he tries to be controlling because... Like with the tattoos, we do this, don't do this, don't do this, because obviously he got her with money, he's scared someone with more money will just come along and just take her. People, well lucky him, people who have a lot of money aren't going to take her. Why would a guy who has a lot of money go after Riri? Like, why would a guy with a lot of money go after any girl? They just could get, they just fuck, like, you know, random whatever. <laughs> like, there's a lot of guys I know who have, like, a lot of money. Are they going after Riri? No, but they don't, like, they don't know how to get a gal normally. Like, sus. Like, you know, it, it, it's a fact, bro. Like, everyone knows in Japan he wasn't with a gal for a really long time. The only reason he's got all these girls in Thailand because he was throwing money around. He admits it himself. Like a lot of people, literally don't know how to get girls without money. So like a lot of guys with money pay for. I feel. I feel like if you're a guy who's a lot of money though, you know how to get girls. There's now he's stuck in Thailand with a fucking cat and a car. He just said, fuck, my life sucks. Let me call him. Oh, you should still visit him. Let me call him. Yeah, we're going. We're going. Oh, yeah, we'll visit him. Content. Oh, no, he's fucking, he's about to cry, bro. Let me call him. Hold on, let me call him. Let's see what happened. Call him to us for content while he's in his emotional distress. Oh. <laughs> Yeah. He's on his phone. 
I'm gonna leave that notifications on. Let me try. Bro. That's so fucking cringe for him. Hello? Yo, bro. I'm with Paul here. Yo, sus. What's up? You good? What happened? Uh, I don't want to talk about it. Well, you're streaming it, so fuck it, right? Yes, I don't want to go into details about it. How are you? How are you and Sam? We're good. We're gonna. We're coming over to Thailand soon. Yeah. Uh, do you have any? Yeah, I don't even know if I'll be here, man. Maybe I don't know. Or maybe I'll be fucking single. Who the fuck knows? I mean, that's what everybody wants, anyway. So. Single? Like, I mean, what, what happened? You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I mean, I don't even know where to start, but. Well, I don't even know what happened. People said you're you're having a rough time, so we're gonna. You know, I'm like, yo, let's see what's going on. I open your stream, and you're like, you know, the stream's pay pointing at a wall. If it was up to fucking chat, I wouldn't be in a relationship. Honestly, I don't even know if my. I don't know, dude. Like, it's just it's like these little lies and stuff like that. And oh my just, god, she cheated on you. No, she didn't cheat on me, asshole. What lies? I'm not trying to be an asshole. I'm just, I mean, you said lies. I don't know. I didn't mean to say asshole. Sorry, but I'm just like, you know, I'm going through it, Paul. I'm going through it. You know, obviously, I'm going through it. No, you're good. I mean, <laughs> you're good. It's all good. Have you had a fight this bad before, Sus? I've had worse fights, to be honest. So then you're chilling, bro. What? She'll come back tomorrow? What's happened lo in, on the other ones? I should come back. I just, I just like, I'm at the point of stage where, like, it's not her, bro. It's really me. Like, I'm at the point right now where it's kind of like, should I just leave? I mean, I'm what? Being honest. What? I mean, what like, happened? I, what? I don't know if I should stay in this relationship. I think, like, 90% of my chat is just always like... Not your chat. Fuck your chat. What are your, what, what are your doubts? Well, hold right on, now? hold on. Like, the, what are your issues? The chat is a big part of his life. Shut the fuck up, bro. I'm serious. Shut the fuck up. I'm serious, bro. Bro, what, what are your actual doubts? Your real doubts deep down? My, my real doubts is that it's like... <laughs> Like, when you're, when you're in a relationship, you obviously are in a relationship. And if you make a fucking agreement with Hannah, mm -hmm. I mean, how do you feel when when Hannah fucking breaks the agreement and doesn't even fucking tell you? Well, what's the agreement? So basically, it was all this shit about, like, work and stuff like that. Like, basically, she was continuing to do, like, her online sales, which I don't mind because she does it from the comfort of her own house, just like if... <laughs> somebody was streaming they're like a bedroom streamer or whatever it's all great i mean all this business stuff is really for i mean it, it's just to show face so that way it's kind of like she brings something to the table i understand that it's important you know people want to feel like they go through life working and making money contributing to the fucking relationship or whatever so i agree and then it was just like all right well they're gonna open we're, we want to open up a brick and mortar store and i was like Tell me more. So then, you know, obviously this seems a little bit lucrative. And I was like, well, I don't mind investing in the, the, the store, but by absolutely no means do I want you working there. And I said that. I was very, very clear. And I was told that she wouldn't work there, that her friend would work there. You know what I mean? And then, like, tonight, I was just, like, messaging. I was like, yo, where are you? Whatever. And she sends me a screenshot of her working exactly what she said that she wouldn't do at the fucking brick and mortar store. So she went from an online, like, like camera woman to a real-life brick and mortar, like, girl. No, doing fucking the, the online Right, you're a fucking idiot. Yeah. She, she sells... One store. second, one second. She sells vintage clothes. <laughs> From home on like Depop type thing, right? Okay. And now, bro, you fucking know. idiot. Whatever, now, dude. I don't know what she, she does. What the fuck? Now she has a now she has a shop selling the clothes in person. But sus, bro. Okay, let me ask you something, sus. When this is my real. Well, sus. When you um when you like go to like Nepal or you go to fucking Korea and stuff like that and you leave, 
First of all, how is she when you're leaving? And second of all, when you're away from her, how is she? Is she like hitting you up like I miss you? Like texting you without you texting her? Like stuff like that. I mean, it, it goes, but it's not the greatest, but it goes. I mean, there are, there's message at least once a day. It's not as much as I would like. Yeah. Like, kind of, fuck, without, you know, the thing is, is, like, I want to be honest with you, but then I also don't want you to, I don't want to come just across do it, as then. a cunt. Then do it, you know? then, but be honest. I just think that, bro, mate, fuck, you need to, you just need to identify if she's actually, like, wanting to spend time with you, do you know what I mean? You should never have to be begging for someone's time, I think you, you know? Should, I think you should cheat on her. Well, it's getting to the point. If you, if you cheat on her, you'll see if she really loves you or not. If you, because you know what I'm saying. I don't yeah. think. I, I don't think. Paul, well, I wouldn't cheat, but I honestly would just. I'd rather just not be in the relationship, to be honest. Well, that's even better, because like yeah, honestly, she was, like, she was breaking down the other day, crying, and she was telling me she was just like my biggest fear. Two of the biggest fears is that you know one of them is that if she had a child. That the child would be sick somehow like i guess women have that fucking fear which i can understand nobody wants to have a fucking you know but bro a that, sick that, child is, bro first she told you she fucking had ca like cancer of her womb and she can't have a kid That's now she's we, no I but now she's care. now she's saying bro maybe she's, she's just trying to get out of getting a kid is what i'm trying to say to you maybe she's just she trying does have a growth all right she yeah. does have a growth you know what I mean? But we didn't go into the specifics. A growth? So like, not, like on your arm. Like inside of her, uh, I don't even know what you would call it. Yeah, in her womb. In her, in her womb. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, but anyway, bro. Make a, short, make a long story short, like, the second fear that she told me is that, you know, that she had a fear that I would leave her. That you would leave her? Yeah. Why does she think that you would leave her? Don't Bro, you? Bro, I need to speak to <laughs> fucking Riri. Don't don't you make I her feel confident? To speak to this girl yeah. and just get to the bottom of it. Absolutely never speak in the Riri, Sam. I, I, I don't trust any of my online friends with this shit. Bro, like I need to work out. Wait like, a second, you girl. don't you don't trust me? I do trust you, Paul, but you already said some nasty shit, and she doesn't feel the greatest about you, first of all. Well, maybe the nasty shit I was saying came from a truthful place. Maybe I don't know. I'm I'm just going through it right now. So like tonight, I I just uh, I need to think. Um, All I'm saying is, if you fuck another girl, you'll see if she cares. If she doesn't care, she'll let you, even if she knows. If she cares, she'll freak out, and that's no, how you know no, you're, you're an idiot. I would because never, I would never do that. First, of all. she's gonna freak out a hundred percent because she doesn't want him moving on to another gal, but that doesn't prove anything. Well, clearly she... that's not the case here. Bro, I would never do that. It doesn't. But the, the thing is, is, like, my, my only option for is like this. I see, like, all these, like, petty little lies, man, and it <coughs> kind of, like, drives me a little bit to the point where it's like, I think of my life, I don't really need this. You know what I mean? Like, I, there, there's, like, fucking millions of girls. I have an idea. Fuck her friend. No, bro. Give me attention. Shut the fuck up, Paul. No, I'm serious. No, Paul, he actually needs advice right now. Sus, listen. Whatever, dude. You think I'm giving bad advice? You're never gonna... I don't think you're ever gonna trust this girl, Sus. The way that she came into your life is, a, is in, in a way that's now in set to put that doubt in your head. Uh, in my honest opinion, you need to just fuck it off, and you need to find a girl, and you need to find her in an honest, legitimate in fashion where she doesn't, there's no money, there's no buying her everything at the beginning, there's none of that shit, and then you'll know moving forward past that point that she actually is interested in you and not your money, bro. If you fuck her you friend, to, you... you'll know if she really likes you. Bro, shut the fuck up, her friend, her best friend is a gay dude, bro, what the fuck are you saying, Paul? No, You're the... saying dumb shit to him for content. No, the girl. The girl. You don't that, actually care. The girl, the girl that wears all the clothes and stuff. Bro, you, you're so bro. The fact you say to anyway, sus, I'm anyway, your real I'm friend. Not, you're you're not, actually you're my friend. friend if you fuck her friend, her friend will have all the secrets because her she will tell her friend, oh, what she really thinks about him. And then when you fuck her, you'll know what she really thinks about you. And you her fuck her friend too. He's a guy. A Whatever. Guy. She has a girlfriend, obviously, that she tells all her secrets to. Like if I was mad or like that one. Never mind. 
What would you do if you were mad? No, I'm just, I don't know. We're all listening. Oh, dude. So, I don't, I don't know. I just have to really think it over tonight, and then, like, if I have enough strength, maybe leave. Oh. Yo, what's up? I literally bought a car yesterday. What did you got? I got a 2021 fucking Suzuki Swift <laughs> with only 13,000 kilometers. This is easy. That's such a cute little car for you, bro. I can I mean, see hey, it now. I know. But it's what are you gonna? Car. I mean, if you break up with Riri, what are you gonna? I mean, what are you gonna do with the car? I mean, she just fucking gave me the <laughs> just now and left it. The lady downstairs talking about don't come to see me. Well, okay, but so what are you gonna do with the car? I mean, she obviously wants you to see her. That's why she left you the key. Wait, is it the apartment you're in? Your and her apartment? Aren't, isn't that shit in there? Dude, I got so much shit in here now. I got I brought a fucking thousand dollar <laughs> fucking desktop computer here. No, but isn't her stuff there? Yeah, all of her stuff, my stuff. I mean, I she's coming home. Like it's not like she's not coming home. It's just I'm I, I need to think about like how to handle this and like I need to think about like what should I do. Like you know what I mean? Like everything you said, Sam, is kind of right. So I'm not gonna lie, but like. I am invested, so like, I, you know what I mean? It's not no, easy. No, I it's think you're away, scared, Sam. bro. You're not ha- it's not easy. Look, it's just No, but listen, away, you think she's hot, right? You probably love fucking her. Mm. And in an ideal world, you want the relationship mm. to work out. But in reality, you know it isn't working out and you don't think it's going to work out. But you don't want to give up on it because you're scared that you're not going to find something else. Bro, I'm telling you, you're going to find something else. <laughs> Yeah, and, and you're going to be more happy with it. You need to just go about it in a different way next Honestly, time. Honestly, I think you should find a nice American girl. I heard cute bots on the market. Looking for a guy named Suspendus. Hey. Cute bot. Well, anyway, I appreciate the call. I still got to deal with this shit. Uh, Bro, I'm, I'm, I'm bong bong. In my heart, Sam, I, I kind of agree with you, Sam. I kind of... You know what I mean? Do you agree with me? Just blowing you off, Sam. I kind of no, 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 you. no. I know. At this point in time, like, you yeah. know. And it's shitty. I mean, you don't want to admit it either. I get it because it's fucking cringe thing you know, to it's say. Kind of it, it's, it's basically I don't want to. What's it? What's cringe? Ultimatum. Like, if you continue to do this, cringe, then I, I will not him. be here for it. And like, she's the type of person that will say, then say it. I will just, do, I won't do anything with my life What's anymore. That? And then it gets me in a fucking weird position where my chat's like, well, you're being a controlling piece of shit. And I'll be like, well. Your chat's fucking incels, dude. They don't know shit. I don't know. I'm just really fucked up right now. And I'm drinking Krypton. <laughs> I'm addicted to Krypton. Sus, you need to go to Kansas City. Kansas. And find us yourself a nice girl. Cause give, him, give him real advice. No, I'm serious. No, I'm giving... Okay, real... Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Whatever, I'm okay, fine. one actual real advice, Paul. No memes, no trolls, no content. Like, give him actually just one, just one, one real advice. One. Come on. Just one. Okay, buddy. All right, listen, sus. Realistically... Would you, no, no, what do you think about Riri? And what would you do if you was in this situation? Okay, I'm going to be completely honest with you. No, I am. I'm gonna be, re, re, I, you should leave Riri. She's fucking wasting your, wasting your time. You should leave Riri. Go to America and hang out with some American people. Maybe your family, whatever. I don't know what the deal is there. Philadelphia, whatever. And then find yourself a nice girl who's just, you know what I'm saying? You can help a girl. There's plenty of girls you can help over there. Help one of those girls. Because honestly, they'll have better values and they speak English. I know. I mean, Thai people have good values, but it's just the wet places he's looking from are just bad. It's toxic. Yeah, he's going to third world countries. No, in Thailand, the, like the ones he's finding, the way he's flashing the money. You want me You want me to give him real advice and then That's you're right, fucking bullshitting him. Get out of stop. No, stop the third world country shit. Go to a fucking country that has values and find a girl there. Bro, America has the worst values in the world. What do you mean, bro? Compared to Thailand? Yeah, Americans are scumbags. Asia has way better values than I'm not, I'm not talking about Asia. I'm America. not talking about Asia. I'm talking about Thailand. Thailand, the place where all they the fucking to... DGENs go. No, no, DGENs go there. Thai people aren't necessarily DGENs, bro. They, they, most families have pretty good values out there. All right, well, you want me to give him real advice, and then you're fucking completely downplaying my advice by giving him dog shit advice.
So what do you want from me? Oh, you're broke. Okay, you're, it started off good and it went bad, but it's fine. He should find a nice American girl. That's a gr that's great advice. The fuck are you talking about? A girl that speaks English and understands his values. I can't really deal with this right now. I just, uh... I don't know. I just, uh... At least find, like, a European girl. Like, I don't think that has anything to do with it. Like Latvia or something. I'm serious. Like Ukraine or something. Plenty of girls there who need help. At the end of the day, you know, her argument, I understand it. I just don't know if I'm okay with it. And, and that's the thing. You know what I mean? Uh, Even Dubai or, like, Saudi Arabia. There's plenty of girls there. Nice Saudi girl. I'm serious. Nice Saudi girl. Marrying to some money? Wait, Sam. I appreciate the fucking call. You, why have you guys stopped streaming? It's early. We're not. We're streaming. Well, Paul is. Did you know this was on stream? He's streaming. Okay. I, I, I'm just going to say I haven't made up the final decision, but like... Break up with her. Like I just don't like breaking up with people. It would be so much easier if she broke up with me. You know what I mean? Then I can hold my head up high and be like, oh, well, it is what it is. Why can't you break up with her? I don't, like, I don't like doing stuff like that. Like, I, man, she could hurt herself, bro. Who cares? It's not your problem. Has she said shit like that before? That, like, she would fucking hurt no. herself if you break up with her? It's not your no, problem. She's never said, she's never said that. Is she, she's she's not going to fucking has hurt she herself. Has she shit like that before? Like, has she hurt herself before in general? No. Okay. Then. Not in front of me or any, when, since we've been together. If a girl ever tells me they would hurt themselves if I, I break, if I break I up have. and I leave them, I don't care. I block them. That's like a... A manipulation tactic. Yeah. No, I know. They're manipulating. They're trying to manipulate me. I don't give a fuck. Okay, if you're going to kill yourself, like, no offense. I don't care. Go tell your family. Like, what am I going to do? Stay with them when I don't want to? Like, I don't care. Like, no offense. I mean, that's a bit intense. They, that's the only thing you can do. What else do I do? Stay with them as they manipulate me and, and like, oh, you, I'm going to kill myself if you leave me. Okay. I'll take that chance. Go ahead. And guess what? They never do. Because it's Stop. fucking bullshit every time. The thing with Sus, though, is he said that he's worried that it's been a big investment. And that's something that's worrying, because that's not a reason to stay with somebody. Yeah. It's just because you've invested time. Sus, listen to this. Maybe tell her, look, I'll give you half of all my money... And I think, no, listen, no, 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 listen, no, but listen. No, but listen. <laughs> well, I'm saying pepper, and I'll give you half of all my money, bitch, if you stay with me. <laughs> fucking idiot. Listen, say to her, look, I'll give you half of all of my money, and we'll go, and we'll go our separate ways. And then, <laughs> wait, and then see how she reacts. And if she's just like, Okay, sure, if that's what you want, and she's willing to go separate ways, then you know, fuck that bitch. But if she's like, no, sus, like, I don't want to, I love you, like, please, like, I don't care about the money, let's be together, then you know she actually cares about you. She would have to be a moron to fall for that. I think, no, no, I Do you know what I'm saying? saying that Who is, would fall for that? Something I mean, like he's that. Believable. I think that's yeah, <laughs> he has to sell it, but she's yeah. watching the stream properly. He'll actually do it. I'm interested you know, like, to see how she'd actually react to that, though. Yeah, I think that that would be really good, though. Just have Evan try to fuck her again, see, what, and see if it works. Shut up. I'm serious. I mean, we're, we're giving out stupid devices. I mean, you know what I'm saying? Bro, <laughs> we have to put the plan into operation that I've been trying to do all this time, Sus. We'll talk about it in messages. I don't want... I don't want you guys meddling in my relationship. I'm listening. Too late for that, buddy. Is he trying to do a girlfriend swap? It's not like a girlfriend swap. Fuck out of here with your weird ass plot stories. By the way, if I wanted to be fucking happy, all I have to do, and this is the crazy part about it. All I have to do is just send one fucking message to Vietnam and I could be happy. Everybody knows that. Like, I'm about to fucking go to Vietnam, man. Fuck this. 
Honestly, you should. Uh, get, fuck Riri, uh, no offense, and go to Vietnam, be happy. Because that's what you deserve. Thank you, Paul. Because, like, what, I mean, this, it sounds like she's adding a lot of stress to your life, and you just don't need that, bro. I'm going to be honest with you. Keep it a buck fifty with I you. I mean, that's exactly, that's exactly what it is. When it's I, just stress, man. Like, I feel like, you know what I mean? You're like, spending I mean, all. I don't deserve to live with this stress. Like, it's just, it's extra stress. Why? You know what I mean? You're spending all this money on this girl, and she's giving you this stress. Fuck that. Go to a girl who gives you no stress, and you yep. spend no money on. You know what I'm saying? Like, what the hell, man? It's all about efficiency in life. Yeah, it's true. I mean, it's okay to take a little bit of stress if the reward of what you get is worth it. Nah, no, you, no, bad like, advice. no, like, like. Like me and Hannah don't have a perfect relationship. We argue sometimes, but it's fine because the 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 the, the other stuff is there. I just don't see that the other stuff's there right now, sus. So that's the problem. You're only getting the negativity, and I don't see the positivity <clears throat> in the relationship. You got to keep it black and white, bro. With sus, I think if it's if there's stress, get out of it. He, so I know exactly the kind of girl sus needs. He needs a girl who's 100 percent for him. Yeah. A girl that's a hundred percent gonna do, die. gonna do yeah, anything for yeah, him. Yeah, yeah. Submissive type. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He can't. No, but he likes to be a bitch a little bit. <laughs> that sus actually likes to be used and abused. He likes sexually, it. but not emotionally. Man, like I literally feel like I'm just fucking. I don't know. She doesn't make me feel like I'm number one. So. You need a girl who's a ride or die. Go to Kansas, middle of nowhere. There's a lot of them. No, bro, shut up with this canvas shit, but yeah, you're right. He needs, he needs, he, uh, here's something. Here. He needs a gal that's like. What was that? Overheating, I think. Sorry. Um, he, oh, low battery. He needs a gal that's gonna be like, that's really gonna make him feel like the shit. Like, hype him up, bro. Yeah, and he, he needs to go. Him and he, like, a nice American girl. I'm telling you, man, American girl. I think it's just hurting you, sus. Am I you pour everything into Riri <clears throat> because you love her and you just want to see it back. Like a fat girl from Kansas. It's when it's not being reciprocated. <laughs> I think that's basically it, Kim. Yeah. Like, I feel like... I'm, I'm, I'm serious, like a fat girl. All of the work. And, like, I don't... You know what I mean? Like... You have a lot of... You have a lot of love to give. And you're constantly giving it and showing it, and you just ask for it back, and I don't think she's doing that for you. <coughs> Which is making you give more and more, wanting to see it, and it's not happening. And it's just hurting you more. And so what is your best advice, Kim? I think you need to sit down and ask yourself how you feel in the relationship with nothing to do... Oh, sorry, one second. <laughs> with nothing to do with other people. Not your friends, not your chat, just how you feel with the two of you off stream, how much she fulfills you, how she makes you feel. She doesn't speak English. Okay, thank you, Paul. And oh, how she you. <laughs> There's no way you guys have deep conversations. Take in all of it the fights, the good stuff, weigh it out because no relationship's gonna be perfect. But I think that it's not... You're putting in more work than she is. Sus, I watched the stream. Emotionally. I've been, I've, been like, watching your, oh. I've been watching your stream with her, bro. You and her barely understand each other. Come on, man. Let's be real for a second. I think that's why Sus wants her to get tattoos and all these things. He wants her because to it, see the love. Yeah, because he doesn't understand what she's saying. No, he doesn't understand. Like, there's no validation because he doesn't understand her. He's scared she's going to leave him. Because he wants to see it. Oh, you're going to stay with me. You love me. Bro, she's pissed as fuck. That's why she said, I'm going to call Riri and I'm going to talk to her. Stop. Bro, I'm just going to fucking talk to her and see what the fuck's going on. Like, I'm, I'm literally just gonna... I told you not to meddle in my life. Your life is... is, is your, you've given up your life, your personal life. Can, welcome uh, to... I can't be in this phone call right now, man. I gotta fucking think about shit. Mm. 
Welcome to live streaming cells. I've got to message you so we can just talk about actual like non like we could talk about in text <laughs> non content wise. And I'll I'll message you. Bullshit, it's all gonna be content eventually. I will too, and I'm not Sam Pepper. So. What the fuck's that mean, Kim? I'm not gonna go on stream and talk about it. Yeah, yeah Sam, Sam will go Sam stream. will say That's it's not for message him. He'll say it's not for content, it's yeah, it's for content. A lot of stuff off stream. Yeah, okay. It's, about on stream. Yeah, you're just waiting for it. It's gonna be Eventually, it's on stream. Yeah, Kim, I get it. You don't trust me. Sus, I'll keep it 100 with you. I will use everything for content at all times. But I will give you legitimate advice while I'm doing it. Mm. I gave him the best advice here so far. You should go to Kansas. Yes. She already just just messaged me, go back to your Vietnamese girl. So obviously... But she wants you to message being like, this is what she wants right now. She wants that sus, which is like, baby, you know I don't want that Vietnamese girl. Like, you're the only girl I want. That's what she wants. And then, like, you're going to give her that, and then she's going to be back. Oh, I've got him under my finger again. I didn't give her that. I asked her, is that what you want? Bro, you should say it. All right, sounds good to me. I already, I always called her S tier anyway. I didn't see how she replies, bro. You have to treat the mean a little bit. Let her swear. Like, let her think that she's going to lose you, bro. Like, this girl's too comfortable. She knows you're scared to lose her. You freak out, bro. Like, you, you can't be the bitch, bro. You've got to, like, take the... You've got to take the reins. Just let her be scared that you're going to leave her. Be like, all right, then. Like, bro, there's more than the Vietnamese girl out there for me. I ain't worried about that. The Vietnamese girl's the same fucking thing as this. Go to Kansas. He's scared. She's scared another girl's gonna get his like the life she's getting. Oh, hairy Vietnamese girl. Bro, go to Kansas. Bro, literally, just tell her, bro. You you need to say to her, sus. Low key, you need to say to her. There are a million other girls what the want what you want, bro. Like, don't you need to you need to fucking think about it right now. She needs to find a way to show you that she likes you for you. And if she can't do that, then that's a red flag. Dude, it is. Nebraska, Idaho, anything. Nebraska came from Missouri. Missouri. Yeah. And that's where it's getting That's me. a good one, too. Yeah. Uh, well, everybody's giving me advice, and if she's going to be pushing me away to another girl, well, then fuck it. You know what I mean? No, bro, I'm telling you, you need to. I'm sorry, the saying is that treat them. <laughs> Uh, treat them mean, keep them keen. I'm telling you, you need what to the switch. Hell? You know, you need to switch the roles, bro. A little bit. You need to get the power in the relationship. Go you to Kansas, be a manzas. You can't be. <laughs> <laughs> you can't be. You can't be ch- having. You can't be chasing her all this time, bro. You need to switch it up. <laughs> <laughs> Trust me, bro. Alpha up a little bit. Let her sweat for a few days. Just tell her, right, look, I'm going to take a few days. I'm chilling, bro. Honestly, this is what he needs to do. Get a hotel, No, no, what, this, this is what you need to do. Nights. This is what he needs to do. Oh while God. I'm serious. While he's arguing with his girlfriend, he's a fuck another girl. So he can, like, under, like so he can get that post nut and be, like, no, clarity. No, she's going to use that against him forever then. Yes, like, yeah. Well, who cares? The relationship's fucked anyways. Fuck another girl while while you got this downtime so you can, no, so you can see if you really... No, no, so you can see if you really like her or not. Or if you like every girl. Because I think he... does like every girl, but this is the one that... The, the, bro, he does... Like, you do like every girl, sus. <laughs> this is just the one that, like... This is the one that he's investing his time in right now. <laughs> Well, that's not good. Just get, it. just end this fucking nightmare already. Like, what the hell? End, end this fucking nightmare, dude. Yeah. Sus. End this fucking nightmare. It's a fever dream. It's time to end it. All right, I gotta get off streaming. I'm just gonna stream. I'm gonna raid one of you guys. I need to chill for a little bit. Uh, I'll message you. Who, who is streaming now? I, I did Paul. <laughs> What, do you not like me or something? I said I'm gonna rage you, Paul. I know, but you sounded, like, sad or something. No, I'm just, I am, I'm not feeling good, obviously. Bro, 
Don't beat yourself up about it. This chick is going to be back on your dick, bro. She ain't going to let you go. Think of her life before you. I know this girl. Listen. Think of her life before you. I know her. She's hard-headed like me. You changed her life, bro. But she's only doing that because she wants to keep you under her control. You, 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 get, let, bro, let her sweat. I'm telling you, she's going to be back on your dick again. If she thinks her life's going to go back to before you, she's going to lose her shit and she'll be on your dick again, bro. Let her sweat. There's a lot Even of... If she doesn't, she didn't like yeah, you to begin with. Yeah, yeah. There's a lot of websites that have girls that have herpes simplex for uh, dating apps, and they are all ready to take your love. All right, Paul, listen to my advice, what I'm saying, though. I'm being for a fucking real with you right now. Bro, you need to make her sweat, bro. Let, let, let her come groveling back to you. I'm telling you, you've got the power in this relationship. Tell her stuff that you actually feel. You've got the power in this relationship, Sus. You... What, 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 do I, what, what, do I, what do I want, Sam, so that I tell her I'm just not happy because the stuff that, I, the stuff that you're doing, I just don't want you to do. Don't literally say that. Look, say, look, I told you something I'm not happy with in this relationship. If you can't fix it, uh, then I'm going to find someone who can give me what I want. Send that Imagine. and then let her sweat for two, three days, bro. She doesn't understand what he says. When it's in text, she will. Oh, yeah. When it's in text, oh, yeah, she let me, text it to She's going to be like, oh, me, Thailand. She doesn't understand. Bro, I'm going to text you. I'm going to text you. All right, then. I'm, I'm, I'm fucking raining, Paul. I gotta just chill. Chat, thank you so much for the 300 gifted subs today, by the way. Uh, <laughs> by the way, somebody said subs and you, Sam. Congratulations, bro. Thank you. Uh, True, Sam so thinks he's Dr. Rain. Phil. Love Fuck you, you Sam. <laughs> <laughs> Love you, bro. All right, text me. <laughs> <laughs> thank you, bro. Shout out to Sus for the raid, hey. I love how he says your name, Paul. Thank you, Sus. I appreciate that. Sus, bro. I'm, let me give you some real advice here, because Sam <laughs> is giving you bullshit. Like he's Sam's giving you content advice. It sounds like I. It sounds like I am because I say stupid shit. But I'm. I'm just saying shit that is like that will make you happy. Sam is pretending to give you good advice. For content. I'm being genuine with you. Stop trying to work things out with this chick. You don't understand each other. Neither of you speak... She doesn't speak fucking English. You can barely speak English to her. Like, just just give it up. Just he let it... He's happy in that type of relationship. He would be happy if he could just... If she just does what he wants and she acts the way he wants, he don't give a fuck about Bro, the she's like she's like fucking a gangster, dude. There's no way that happens. No, he needs to he find a girl train that's train her. Train her. Yes. Dude. What do you mean, bro? He can train her. If she wants the treats, then she does what he says. All right, I'm going to be completely real and I really hope Sus does not hate me for saying this, but I I have to just say it. Because this is fucking insane. She's got dreads and he's four feet tall. There's no way he's training this chick. Okay. He can, bro. He needs to just alpha up. No. For sure he can. I, he has the <laughs> money. He has the fame. He has the fucking career. All of her career, the fucking shop she just opened, her online business is all funded by him. Why? She stopped working as a bar girl because of him. He has all the power. All she has is the pussy, and he can get that anywhere. I know, but why? He needs to why would? Him. Why would he? No. Why would he stay with her? There's a million girls who don't. Don't need to be trained Hannah why would he want to train her waste his time training Bro, girls Hannah, I'm telling you, he, the sus sus is too old for that listen yes because but Hannah she acts like a dog bro I mean, I didn't call. I, I didn't call his girlfriend a dog, but you know. No, what I'm but he doesn't care. Re he doesn't care for a real relationship. I know, sus. He doesn't. So why do you care? Why do Why do you want him to stay with Riri then? Be long term with her. Why do you want him to stay with Riri? That's what's gonna make him happy. In no. His head. He wants. To, no, I'm telling you, in his head, Dude. he just wants to have a gal. Are you fucking with me?
Bro. Is it for content? No, I'm not. <laughs> Bro, Riri is awful for him. He yes, but he doesn't care. As long as she behaves, she fucks him, she acts as his girlfriend. But she's not doing that. She's, she's, exactly. she's not. That's why I'm so, saying. okay, hold on. She's not fulfilling her role. So he needs to leave her and find a girl who will, which there's a million girls who will. And there's I know, but you know he doesn't want doing? to go through that effort. There's no effort. What effort is there? There's no effort. No, wait, hey. She's, bread cu <coughs> she's breadcrumbing. She's doing this thing where you give a little bit no, we of did what it. the person wants. All right, well, fucking get rid of her. Who what cares? What did you say? That's crazy, though. Do you know what I'm saying? Like, well, they can. Bro, that doesn't he's matter. gonna have a kid, bro, with her. Whatever, like, not, he, not he, yet. Like, he doesn't give a fuck about anything else, bro. Whatever, dude. Find a girl who will fit his what he's looking for, the role he's looking for. Because clearly, she's not it. She's like an alpha gangster. He is not an alpha gangster. Bro, in the chat, anyone in the chat who's saying that retarded, <laughs> you don't actually understand sus. If you like. I talk to him, bro. I talk to him. He doesn't care about being used and abused. He wants... He really just wants to, like... He doesn't care. Like, it is a good... He <coughs> likes the fact that he, like, all, all, literally is paying for a girl. But she's just not holding up to her end of the bargain. That's the only reason he's upset. Well, right, but why should yeah. you try to change somebody instead of no, I mean, doing that? Yeah, I mean, well, she's, not fulfill she's not fulfilling. She's not fulfilling her saying, role because he doesn't want to start again. He doesn't want to risk it. Like, but that's you shouldn't stay with somebody because you've invested time in them if they're not the type of person that he likes. He likes the way she looks. He likes the way she dresses. He's only been with her for like two care. months. Who cares? Don't care about her personality, bro. You it's only care about any girl's personality. It's only been like two months, dude. Who can like just find a new girl? It's been two months. Who cares? It's he literally just wants a gal that he can just fucking. I mean, it's, it's a superficial relationship. You only need yeah. about three days to get into another one. Who cares? Yeah, true. So like, well, I don't think he's gonna have that mentality. To well, because you're giving him stupid fucking advice. You're giving him advice for shit that's irrelevant. That's why he's not doing it. I'm oh just, yeah, talk to her. Yeah, dude, she doesn't. Yeah, they don't yeah, understand he each other. He's gonna drop her, bro. That's the thing. Oh, well, he could if you fucking convince him. Not but you're you're like if pretending not, to give him real advice, I am. dude. Who you know what I'm saying? Like, dude, they, they she doesn't even speak English. There's no way they have this like when you connection. Test her. Oh. That's oh, it's charged. <laughs> Try like, would that be good? Try it with your butt clear. <laughs> no! Yeah, it's broken. Oh, it's working. I hear it. All I'm saying is, like, yeah, who cares? I don't know. It's just. Yeah, I'm giving. I was advice. giving him real advice. <laughs> Sam's song. giving him fake fucking advice for content. That's to be insane. honest. It looks insane. Do you not? Do you not think? Oh, it has like a post mode. Yeah, tell me. Do you not think you're giving him fake advice for content? No, I'm not. No, because he wants to be with her. And <coughs> I just know, guys, when you, a guy really wants to be with a gal, they don't listen to the advice about the breaking up. Yeah. It, you know, like when people tell you, "Oh, break up with someone," you mm -hmm. you know what I mean. It's like you don't listen to that because you want to be with that person. So at least I'm I mean, to, to be honest, they may not be wrong. To try and make the relationship an actual relationship he wants, and then when he tries that and that doesn't work out, then he'll learn on his own. Yeah. <laughs> on. There's sometimes you just can't give people advice to just end the relationship because, like, he ain't gonna do that. Well, the advice to tell her how he's feeling and all these problems is good advice. No, the, but she doesn't give a fuck. That's the advice. You, I guess, but you you saying to train her, it's not going to work long term. No, it isn't. But then he'll learn and he'll leave. You know? I think you should just cheat on her. But then what's the point? I don't know. That would just cause more fights. It'll just draw it out. No, he needs, to, he needs to be a fucking man. For, for he needs to be a fucking man. Cheat on her. And then when she gets mad, be like, bitch, I don't give a fuck. And then fuck herself. Why would you even do that? You should just break up. Bro, right, he's not being serious. No, I'm being serious. I'm, st I'm serious. Okay, if that's your energy with relationships, that means that when you and Kim get in a fight and it's not working out, you're just going to cheat on her. No, I don't need to do that. Why not? Because I'm not sus. Why is it, why is so, it only yeah, applied to sus? sus? Because sus clearly has like a different, doesn't understand how to do relationships, you know what I'm saying? So, I... <laughs>
Exactly. Yeah, that fucking. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Why? So why are you in a different league? Because I know. I don't. I know how to do. I know how to do. Because I know how to do relationships. Yes. What do you know? What can you teach? Because I know I. Okay. First of all, you speak English, so I can have a genuine conversation with you. Sus can't have a genuine conversation with the with the girl. See, might as well just cheat on her. Fuck a different girl. Fuck her again when she's mad. Fuck it. Who cares? So, because I know English. Yes. Well, that's a big, you know, a big help. Well, I can Anything have, else? like, I can have intimate conversations with somebody who has a higher level of English. Come <laughs> <coughs> on. Let's grapple. I mean, I'm going to put it, I, I did have sex with one girl who didn't speak English. Yeah. When I was in Japan. Mm. And that bitch was retarded. I didn't know what the hell was going on. I didn't even know. I didn't even know. She, I was like, "Yo, do you consent to like getting fucked?" And she was like, "She had to like make the first move because I didn't know what she was. You know, what I'm saying I didn't know what was going on." Uh, come on. And then eventually, when we were fuck, even when we were fucking, I didn't know like we, there was no conversation. Did you do thumbs up. Well, so yeah, like literally high fives and shit. Like there was no conversation whatsoever. I didn't know what was going on. I wanted her to fucking suck my dick, and then she was just like, you know, I'm just like, yo, fucking suck my dick, like you know. She was like, what? And I'm. Just, you know what I'm saying? So, I was like fucking like Segor in my dick. I don't know. It was like, it was just cringe. I can't imagine a whole relationship like that. <laughs> well, thank God you got the beautiful Pimbley now and you don't have to talk about having sex with girls that don't English, speak English so anymore. We're good. Yeah. No, no, that's really helpful. Yeah. All right, hold on. Um, that's it. Right. You're, you, you've not really been killing it recently. With what? Steak. I've got to be real with you. I'm doing better than you. With what? Winnings. Winnings? <laughs> what did you win today? Yeah, I mean, I got like 1,000 for 400. Yeah, yesterday I, I won 1,000 too. Yeah. But you're gambling 3k. <coughs> 7k? 7k. <laughs> Whatever, dude. I won 70k last, like two weeks ago. Pull that car across. How many times do you keep losing me? <coughs> Tonight, you're gonna win. Okay. You have to manifest it. What, like, what are you feeling? What's gonna get him there? 